What's up guys, it's Bebe Hey. Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, then welcome to my channel. I'd love it if you guys subscribe and stick around. For this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how I take and edit my Instagram pictures. This has been a highly requested video, so I really wanted to film it for you guys. So I use Aspen Overt's presets. Shout out to her because they are amazing and I really love them. So pretty much I'm just gonna go get changed into another outfit and then I'll head out, take you guys along with me so you guys can see um, a location and how I take my pictures and then we'll come back and I will edit using Aspen's presets I'm just going to put one on one of the photos and show you guys the adjustment <laughs> the adjustments that I do so I'm just gonna go get change and then I'll head out pictures on my iPhone in burst mode. I love using burst mode because it allows you to capture 10 photos every second. To use burst mode you just tap and hold the shutter button in the camera app and this allows you to capture so many different movements and facial expressions and there are a lot of images to choose from so there will definitely be a picture that you're happy about. After I take a burst, I just go to it in my photos app and I scroll through and you can select your favorite photos from the burst. So here I'm just selecting a couple different poses that I really like. And you can just look at your facial expressions and the movements that you're doing just to see which ones you like the best. And then once I've finished going through it, I will just click done and I can decide if I want to keep the entire burst or the five favorites. So here I'm just keeping the entire burst. Then I will go to the Lightroom app and I'm going to pick one of the pictures that I like the best. And I'm going to turn the oranges down to about a 40 and then the yellows down about 30. And then I'm going to save the image to my camera roll. Then I'm going to add the picture that I just edited to the Lightroom app. And I'm going to go to Aspen's presets and copy the settings of her dreamy preset. That's the one that I always use. And I'll go back to the photos and I'm going to paste the dreamy preset onto the picture. Then I'm going to go to the color palette and turn the red hue down to a zero. I'm going to turn the oranges down some more because I still feel like I look a little orange to about a 15. I'm going to turn the yellows down to about an 80. Then I'm going to go to the greens and turn that down to about a 50 just because I don't like my pictures very green. I'm not going to do anything to the turquoise. Then I'm going to turn the blue to a hue positive 15 because I like mine a little bit more blue and less turquoise. I don't do much with the lighting. It just really depends on the photo. So here I'm just turning the highlights down a little bit. Then I'm going to save it to my camera roll. Then I'm going to add the photo to the Facetune app and I'm going to adjust my skin tone. So I select the picker and I pick what color I want to adjust everything and I use the toner and just kind of lightly go over the spots that I want to adjust. So I'm doing my hand and a little bit on my face. And then after that, I will just do the before and after so I can see what adjustments that I did to make sure that I like it. And then I'm going to save it to my camera roll. Then I'm going to go into the Unum app and I'm going to add the picture. This is where I can see if it matches my feed and if there's any other last minute adjustments that I need to make. And I love it because then I can see what other pictures I've already posted to make sure that it looks good. 
So I'm just going to show you guys the before and after so you guys can see the edits that I made. Aspen's presets make it super quick and easy to edit. I might change the exposure or a couple other adjustments depending on the lighting that I shoot my pictures in. And that's pretty much it. Well, that's it to how I take and edit my Instagram pictures. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Leave in the comments down below if you guys have any other video suggestions. Or if you have any questions about how I take and edit my Instagrams that I didn't clarify. And I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.